Hello everyone, I am meteorologist Hutch Johnson joining you and I want to give you some bonus coverage of an unsettled week ahead. Now, we're not getting a lot of snow all at once, but it's going to be a progressive pattern where we get these quick chances of mixed precipitation and even some areas with some light snow that by the end of the week could make a big difference. I do believe the majority of any snow accumulation will happen Wednesday and beyond, but Tuesday, Wednesday, and Thursday, three days in a row of unsettled weather, and that means Tuesday through Thursday, we're going to have a chance of seeing some significant or more significant accumulations in some area. On Tuesday, we'll have mixed precipitation early, but by Wednesday, gusty wind from the north will cool things off, and it looks like snow all snow for those getting it. Not all areas will see snow. That continues throughout much of the day on Thursday as the system exits. And here's the key point. There will be a total accumulation over the three days that will have a chance at being somewhat significant. And again, it's not going to be all in one day. So please keep that in mind as we work our way in to the latter part of the week. We're not getting all this at once. This is not a forecast of what you can expect on the ground by tomorrow. This is this kind of total uh, prolonged period of light snow here and there that will add up. Let me show you what I mean. And we're going to start with a look at the European model. This is the one that I believe has been doing the best in our area over the last few years. I do want to point out that the European model here is essentially showing that we have some heavier snow potential as we see the darker blue and white colors. So here they are up in northwest Minnesota towards the Lake of the Woods County. So up in those areas, this model is saying uh, three rounds of snow adding up some areas seeing over an inch, but where you see the whiter colors there, we could have a few places getting a few inches of snow. Now remember, Hutch doesn't get too excited about snowfall amounts that far out, but it does show that we could have some measurable snow totaling up over three days, Tuesday, Wednesday, and Thursday, and into your Friday morning, it should be all done. Now, let's take a look at another model. That was the European model. Here's the American model. Notice we have similar location for the snow, fairly similar amounts. It might be a little bit heavier north of the border where you see the pink colors, but by and large, by the end of the three different waves of precipitation. We could see some measurable snow in far northern portions of Minnesota. And one more model just to wrap this up to show us a little bit about what the uh, Canadians are thinking with their model. Their forecast model shows some very similar tracks. So this combined together, three models three long range models. So we're going out there on a limb. We're not going to get too specific about these amounts. Please don't uh, staple those to Hutch. But we will say measurable snow over the total of the three events. Uh, it could be over a good two to three inches in some spots. We're going to keep you posted. And that is by Thursday night. So some roads will be slippery. I'll have updates on that. Some areas could have some shovel trouble. And it's that kind of snow you get kind of tired of because it's going to come with a lot of north wind beginning uh, Wednesday and into Thursday morning. And that wind will be persistent and a little gusty at times as well. That's a look at your forecast. Thanks for subscribing to my YouTube channel. Search Hutch's Weather on YouTube today for the latest on that. And follow me for Facebook Lives because I want your input.